Welcome to our home. Hello, everybody. And uh, this is uh, my sister in Christ. Hello, Evelyn. Hello, everyone. Mm -hmm. uh, our topic tonight, what is? The Before we start, uh, okay. I think I'm, yeah, going, go ahead to, I'm going to start uh, to pray. Our opening prayer. Okay, thank you. Let's bow our head. Okay. Dear Heavenly Father, we come to you. We give you glory. We honor you, Father God. Father God, first, we humble ourselves before you, Lord Jesus. Father God, clean our mind, heart, and soul, Lord, because we love you. You Almighty God, King of King of Heaven, Father God. We need your presence tonight and uh, be, uh, be with us, Lord. You are in the center of everything we're doing tonight. Father God, Thank you for uh, Calvary and the cross, Father God. Lord, you are our Lord, the Savior, Lord. Lord, we love you. We love you, Lord Jesus. Lord, wherever uh, come out our lips, that's the people that are going to listen to this one, our topic, the power changing, and uh, us, Father God. Lord, bless them. Bless uh, this program. Uh, Lord, the, you're the, in, in control of everything, Father God. Thank you for all your blessing. We give you glory. We honor you in the blood of Christ Almighty King. In Jesus' name, Amen. Amen. Okay, we're gonna we're gonna read the word uh, the uh, the power the how to change our life in biblical way. The biblical way. Right. Read it. Uh, if you don't mind, read it. Uh, read the uh, Second Timothy three. Listen. Second Timothy. Yeah. Three. Yeah. Okay. Second Timothy. Second Timothy three sixteen. Three sixteen. Yes. And then uh, we start to how the the life our life changing. Okay. To Where is Second Timothy? <laughs> Second <laughs> Timothy. That's right there. Huh? Okay. Sorry. Right okay. There. All right. Uh, Second Timothy. Um, chapter 3 verse yes. 16 it says here all scriptures is inspired mm -hmm. by God and is useful to teach us what mm -hmm. is true Hallelujah. and to make us realize what is wrong in our lives Yes, it yeah. corrects us when we are wrong and teaches us to do what is right mm -hmm. God yeah. uses to prepare and equip his people to do every God's good work Amen. You know, Evelyn, Amen. honestly, this is actually one of my favorite mm -hmm. because I do believe that all scriptures, God's word, can can transform a person's life mm -hmm. and Hallelujah. can transform our heart. I think God can transform our, our heart, can change us, and especially yes, if we humble ourselves to Praise our Lord you. Jesus Christ. <laughs> and um, yeah, and if we can... We can use that in every God's good work. Yes, uh, you know my own experience, uh, Edith. Mm -hmm. And uh, if you read yeah, the Bible, uh, first I pray first, God, mm -hmm. uh, lead me in the Holy Spirit. Right. And uh, I open the Bible or listening the you know all the prayers and listen to the Scripture my mind is changing mm -hmm. changing instead of what you're gonna do today mm -hmm. you know and say god leave me the holy spirit and you're the only one changing everything in my life you're the one is gonna change everything for my family my work uh, you know because he's the one uh, in control in my life because if you uh the Word of God is a very powerful. Absolutely. Yeah, they change, that. changing so much before and now. My old is gone. Mm -hmm. uh, especially my attitudes. Believe me, if I don't, you know, if I don't read the Word, of my attitudes is is I don't know. This and what's happening? <laughs> yeah, it's true. Yeah. <laughs> At least, you know, uh, sister, I did. Mm -hmm. Even uh, you know, you read, mm -hmm. you you're able to control yourself. 
get angry and then, then uh, you know, sometimes anger, God help me. Yeah. I need your help. Absolutely. And then they control my tongue. They mm-hmm. control what I'm going to say. Yeah. What do you think? Yeah, I do agree. Um, yeah, God can change the heart. Mm-hmm. of a person he's the only one who can actually change us especially if we humble ourselves to him mm-hmm. you know uh, I remember when um, when I accepted Jesus Christ yes, as my Lord as, and my Savior mm-hmm. and start reading his word you know I start is reading the Bible yes uh, and start of course it's a good thing that God also provide um, you know support group and resources to uh, study Bible mm-hmm. study. Yeah. That's where actually that God transformed my heart. So I know I'm. Um, I know that I believe that I'm a different person now. I'm yes, a new creation. Yeah. I know while we're here in this world, I know we still have a plus. Mm-hmm. But I know if you um, if you really mm-hmm. um, follow God's word. I think uh, you know you your your faith and you know he you become uh, strong in your faith and mm-hmm. you know Hallelujah. you you are careful to hurt someone mm-hmm. and all the bitterness in your yes. life and all the people that wrong you mm-hmm. you forgive them because that's God how can transform and God is love love mm-hmm. that's mean to say if you love God yes, you know Hallelujah. you love also other people and you follow his ways and the only way that uh, you follow his ways is to really fix your eyes on God's yes, word hallelujah. and uh, follow follow his command yes. not only by words and also by actions yes, i know hallelujah. there's a, if you are a true believer of Christ yes, you know you always follow and really seek his face and yes, he said king, seek his kingdom first and all be added unto you amen so. amen remember i told you john 14:15 mm-hmm. yes and just uh, if you love me, you obey my commandments, mm-hmm. and that that's why you know, if you really love Jesus, all your heart, all your mind, all your soul, you know, He's in control. He's in control everything in you. Like uh, you submit, you submit everything for Him. You know, if you submit everything for Him, mm-hmm. you surrender for Him. Y- your problem is like light, a plus. You have a full of joy, you know. The joy you can explain like overflowing mm-hmm. inside of your soul. That's Sometimes true. I always say, "I got joy like a river. I got joy like a river. I got joy like a river in my heart." Amen. Hallelujah. Glory, glorify your name. Glory be to God. Yes. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yes. I'm gonna. I'm go, going go. to. I'm going to read it all. Um, this is the one I like it a lot. Mm-hmm. Hebrews 4.12 mm-hmm. For the word of God is alive and powerful. Mm-hmm. It is sharper than sharpest two-edged sword cutting between soul and spirit. Mm-hmm. Between joint and marrow, it is exposed our innermost thought and desire. See that? Desires, yeah, you know, God know what our desires. Everything is, um, you know, I, you know. I remember the, I remember uh, the one lady always visiting me, mm-hmm. and she said, "Hey, sister, do you know God knows how to count your hair? Did you count your hair? Do you remember? He created heaven and earth." Mm-hmm. Okay, and God knows ca- about your count your hair. Do you know that is very very powerful? You know, and that trust God, trust God, trust God. Oh, that's why I told you trust God all your heart, all your skin. Let God handle mm-hmm. all your problem, your family, your husband, especially. Oh God, God be the glory. Especially, I have a lot of problems. You know. <laughs> now, Evelyn, I'm just gonna ask you a question. Yeah, How God changed you? Changed us? Yeah. How Lord. did when when did you accept Jesus Christ in your life and how He changed your life? You know what? I remember we went to Japusa. Mm-hmm. What year that one, Jimbo? Nineteen. 
1994-95 Dia pusa Jesus People USA 95 That's why they, you know I feel good They doing uh, worship mm-hmm. And then They talk about Jesus I, Something Something uh, uh, Change Inside in my heart mm-hmm. Something I feel peace Something Happen Miracle I think I remember I um, my uh, first baptize uh, you know the Jimbo my first baptize uh, you know Pastor Mark Job I remember that yes yes and then and then uh, it's a uh, it's amazing <laughs> God be the good oh you like church <laughs> The New Life Church and the Pastor Mark Yob. I remember that was Pastor Mark. Mark Yob is a he's a president of uh, Moody, mm-hmm. WMBI. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I used to be a you know I go all, over there. Yeah. He is a wonderful, amazing pastor, Mark Yob. Mm-hmm. Yes, and then now we go in the I baptize again. Mm-hmm. You know, I baptize. Yeah, Jimbo. First one is in the swimming pool with Mark Cho. Yeah, first Mark. The Marcus. second one was with Pastor Dan. The Pastor Dan is amazing. First Church of God. Of yeah, that's one uh, uh, deeper my trouble in my life. In that time, uh, uh, Edith, mm-hmm. I, I get the trouble in my life, problem, mm-hmm. and I lost everything. Our house in uh, December. Uh, no, no, no. December 13th, this December. 2013 December 16 we lost everything mm-hmm. I remember uh, yeah burn, uh, burning uh, burn our house mm-hmm. and uh, we homeless two months mm-hmm. two months and uh, my husband uh, you know he was a uh, severe depression and my hus- my son I don't know where at that uh, yeah depressed too oh he jumped out the, the window, jump in the window yeah, those one. The house actually blew up. Yeah, they wow. blow up, and then uh, you know I'm shocked. I I think uh, I feel like I'm fainting mm-hmm. the time. I faint. Mm-hmm. I faint. I feel like that was a life changing yeah. thing that happened. A big time life. Yes, thing. Uh, and we had money more after that. <laughs> yeah, and wow. the time it, it, it's See, a miracle. Miracle. Is a miracle. Yeah, everything is a miracle. Because you know what? I stay in the Word of God. The Word mm-hmm. of God helped me so much. And pray, pray. I bent my knees. I said, God, I need your help. Mm-hmm. Watch over her, my, my, uh, my, our son, uh, my Matthew. husband, Matthew. and Matthew. Mm-hmm. And Mary. the time is Mary. Trevor. Yeah. And, uh, you know, all my family. Jack. Yeah, and I pray for you know my family. Mm-hmm. And Barbara, Uncle Joe. And there is a time that you know only you can do is talk to God to pray for pray for Him. You yes. need help, and that, that that's yes. why they changed now tremendously my life. Edith, mm-hmm. tremendously. Mm-hmm. Go ahead. How about you? How you change your life? How when do you accept Jesus? Jesus in your heart. <laughs> you know. Well, I uh, I know that the uh, first thing that uh, happens is, uh, you know, yes. Jesus changed everything. Yes. About me, starting with my heart. Yes. Uh, I know. I remember when I went through mm-hmm. um, storms in my life that uh, I know God uses that sometimes mm-hmm. to, you know. Uh, yes. To build our character, yes, hallelujah. and also to seek Him, right? So yes. I start actually reading the Bible, mm-hmm. and um, so at that time, uh, there's a lot of bitterness and yes. there's a lot of uh, anger. Mm-hmm. And I know I remember uh, in my heart that I was like, I thought that I was like doing the right thing, that I was a good mom, I was a good wife, mm-hmm. I'm a good daughter, I'm a good sister, I'm a good person. But 
That's not true. I mean, mm. God showed me. Yes, hallelujah. You know what's wrong in my life, and um, He actively changed my heart, and uh, I start weeping. Mm-hmm. and uh, really praying and I know it says here in 1 John chapter 1 9 it says if we confess our sins he is faithful and and just to clean us from all un- un- unrighteousness mm-hmm. and that's where the convictions in mm-hmm. my heart and I start uh, praying yes, and hallelujah. asking God for forgiveness and you know he showed me all the wrongs in my life and all the things that I did wrong and I thought I was doing you know I know I'm not perfect uh, but at that time I thought I was doing the right thing and mm-hmm. um, so when the when God showed me you know he humbled me and yes, uh, I start praying and asking for forgiveness and you know it's a process I know it's not just you know one click your chains so it's a process actually so uh, but when you know I start that I you know, I'm, I tried now. It's before I was like, so yes. if somebody hurt me or say something about the me, that nah, yeah, I I kind of like, you know, um, go back and you know say something, right? Yes, uh-huh. say something bad to that person or or speak evil. Yeah, yeah. Uh, but now I watch what the words that comes from my mouth. Yes. You know, and uh, one thing that uh, I think it's uh, Galatians 5, yeah. mm-hmm. uh, the fruit of the Spirit. That's mm-hmm. the first thing that I always pray that yes. God give me the fruit of the Spirit. Whereas, because God is love, God is peace, right? Yes. Mm-hmm. And God is holy. So mm-hmm. I ask for. Um, for the fruit of the spirit and so also self control and i see yeah. a lot of us and long suffering is yeah. my favorite long suffering right. <laughs> because a lot of us doesn't have self control and i'm one, i'm guilty on that so yeah. uh one thing that's uh that i'm working on and uh, of course with the help of god because i know we i cannot do it on my own uh, mm-hmm. so i have to uh, ask god for help and of course you know really mm-hmm. um really focus on his word and studying yes, his hallelujah. word meditate on his word and uh, not only by um, speaking his word but also in action so I think obedience is number one so that's yes, what obedient yes and uh, I'm asking for um, the discernment uh, the divine wisdom yes hallelujah. Uh, so that you know we know that uh, he gave us a free will yes to hallelujah. make a choice um, and by asking his divine wisdom, mm-hmm. I think God will show me, you know, the right thing, you know, yes. to the right path. So, uh, and I want to be example, only, not just only, um, not for myself, uh, you know, my selfish ambition yes, is also hallelujah. to point others to them, uh, to God. Mm-hmm. And hallelujah. at the same time, um, by being an example, I hope that uh, they can see Yes, Jesus hallelujah. in me. So, uh, not only on uh, mm-hmm. other people, but also with my family. And mm-hmm. of course, you know, I know that uh, even Jesus Christ was hallelujah. being criticized on that. But uh, I know that uh, we still have a flaws. That's what I said. Until we, you know, while we are here in this world, so this is a fallen world. There's a lot of uh, negativity, and yes. uh, there's a lot of. Uh, Things that's going on, violence, yeah. murder, you know, uh, name it, that uh, evil things. And mm-hmm. that's why we are asking uh, that we have to continue praying and asking God and we really seek Him. Yes, hallelujah. Okay. Mm-hmm. You know, a lot of things that we need to change, especially our character, mm-hmm. character and uh, our attitude. Oh, believe me, my attitude is changing a lot. Mm-hmm. Yes, because if we, I don't have God in my life, mm-hmm. uh, because uh, a lot of things in my life, the I change tremendously, you know. And uh, I will, I want to read the uh, Titus, mm-hmm. a thousand mm-hmm. Titus, yeah, Titus. Titus 3, 5. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Three. Oh, hold on one second. Mm-hmm. I know it's right here. <laughs> Titus. 
<laughs> I said <laughs> Titus. I put already 1,000. Where is this? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Do you want me to read the Romans 12 too? Yeah, read it. Okay, it says here that we are instructed to be transformed Mm -hmm. and changed into the likeness of the image of Christ. Yes, that's a good Uh, one. It says um, in copy of the behavior, the custom of this word, but let God transform you into a new person Mm -hmm. by changing the way you think. Mm -hmm. That's very important. Right? Mm-hmm. Yes. Mm-hmm. Hallelujah. Right here. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Uh, Titus, Titus 3, mm-hmm. chapter 3, verse 5. Mm-hmm. He saved us not because of the righteous things mm-hmm. he had done, but because of his mercy. Mercy. He was away our sins, giving us a new birth, a new life through the Holy Spirit. You know, if we have a, especially if we have a relationship with Christ, Mm -hmm. if we have a relationship uh, with Him, and uh, it's something miraculous uh, happened, uh, changing our life daily. It's a daily, daily, every day. And, uh, you know, like a Holy Spirit live in us. And uh, we we think people saying now in everything. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Yeah. And you know, one thing also, it says knowing God is changed everything about my life. Yes. Hallelujah. And who I was. Yes. Right. Hallelujah. And that's what I said. Uh, God changed me mm-hmm. tremendously. Yes. Uh, and I see that in my life mm-hmm. um, I'm a changed person now I'm not I'm not the used to be mm-hmm. I know uh, before Hallelujah. before you know I, if you say something bad to me I will say I will get back to you and say bad things also <laughs> uh, but don't get me wrong I'm not yeah. you know trying yeah, to uh, <laughs> be perfect but yeah mm-hmm. and sometimes that's why uh, the fruit of the spirit is very important yeah. because that covers everything love peace joy mm-hmm. kindness goodness mm-hmm. gentleness uh, patience faithfulness long suffering and self control <laughs> right so long suffering right <laughs> because you know it says here um, God's God is God is actually if you know the character of God, yes, God, God is, will change you for mm-hmm. that, right? Mm-hmm. So that's the one thing that uh, I was, uh, you know, because God is holy. Yes, yes it hallelujah. It says here, there's a lot of God's att- attributes. Yes, and uh, we need to be, I know that we cannot be like God, but, you know, we He actually made us yes, like hallelujah. His image, right? His yeah. image. Mm-hmm. So there's a goodness of us, mm-hmm. you know, mm-hmm. gracious. Hallelujah graciousness his holiness mm-hmm. it says here he is, almighty is yeah he is omniscient yeah. omnipotent he's all good all yes, powerful hallelujah. all knowing hallelujah. all you know so i mean me, me, the most important that he is a loving god and i think yes hallelujah. it says here for god to love the world yes right? hallelujah. and also he said the the, the first um commandments that he said to love him first and yeah. then love others as ourselves so mm. that's very important yes love love your god all your heart all your strength all your soul love mm-hmm. like uh, love your neighbor mm-hmm. okay mm-hmm. you know that i like a just was chapter one mm-hmm. verse eight and nine mm-hmm. uh, about we're talking about the word of god mm-hmm. and they said uh, little this one just what chapter 1 verse 8 study this book of instruction continu- continually mm-hmm. meditate on it day and, and night, night. Mm-hmm. so you will be sure to obey everything written in it mm-hmm. only then will you prosper and su- succeed in all you do mm-hmm. verse 9 mm-hmm. this is my command they said that mm-hmm. what is it Command. This is my command. So God's command. That command. God's yeah. command. Uh-huh. Yeah. Be strong and courageous. Do not be afraid, discouraged. Uh-huh. For the Lord your God 
uh, is with you whatever you go is whatever you go mm -hmm. you know uh, that is a command remember this word uh, this Bible is a word of God breathing from him the Holy Spirit the the breathing and then to you know if the Holy Spirit is in us mm -hmm. you're gonna understand you're gonna understand every book every word in the Bible like instruction right yeah mm -hmm. and uh, you know the would you please say can you read the second Corinthians second 570 you have a five minutes now second Corinthians do yeah. you have it yeah Second Corinthians. Mm -hmm. Here, here, in Corinthians. 5.17. 2 Corinthians 5.17. 5, 17. Okay, 5.17. Here. Okay. okay, so it says here, this means that anyone who belongs to Christ yes, hallelujah. has become a new person. Amen. The old life is gone and a new life has begun. Yes, That's hallelujah. Really. So yeah. you're a new creation. Yeah. So when That's God changes us, we are now a new creation. So, yeah. Right? So uh, Jesus is living us. Yeah. We're no longer our old self. We're no longer yeah. slave to love. fear. Yeah. <laughs> I like that song. <laughs> yes. So I am a child of God. <laughs> I am a child of God, right? I like that song. I'm a child I of God. Am a child I of God. God. Yes. Okay. So mm -hmm. and um I uh, think we're gonna have a tonight. Uh-huh. Because uh we're gonna have a part two about uh yeah. We're oh, gonna have a part two next uh a next change. time we'll see it. Uh -huh. uh, next time, uh, the life of changing power, accepting Jesus Christ as your savior. Mm -hmm. Savior. A That's savior. Uh, mm -hmm. uh, we have a part uh, uh, part two. Mm -hmm. Okay, tonight. And uh, would you like uh, about that? You know, prayer, closing prayer. A closing prayer. Yeah. Is it about repentance? Yeah, repentance. Okay. Uh, a closing prayer. Yes, hallelujah. About repentance. Mm -hmm. Okay, so, okay, it says yes. here, I'm sorry mm -hmm. about that. And, um, yeah, so we are going to uh, pray. Yes, uh, pray the, the yeah. repentance. If you have uh, any uh, questions, any question or uh, you have a comment, mm -hmm. yeah, and then do you, do you, uh, don't forget to say like, comments, and subscribe subscribe <laughs> <laughs> like comments and subscribe uh, yeah. okay uh, yeah mm -hmm. all yeah. right uh so we're gonna ask for um repentance yes right? hallelujah so it says here if you confess uh, with your mouth hallelujah. that Jesus is Lord and believe in your heart hallelujah. that God raised him from the dead hallelujah. you will be saved Mm -hmm. For it is by believing in your yes. heart that you are made right Praise with God. Jesus. And it is by confessing with your mouth Hallelujah. that Amen. you are saved. Amen. So believe that, uh, simply believe that uh, God Amen. forgive us already on our sins Amen. and uh, that He's a perfect Hallelujah. God and Amen. He loved us so much Amen. that He sent His Son Jesus Christ to save us. Amen. So if we must believe amen. that He says that He is the God of all. So amen. and uh, whoever believes in Him and accepted Him, amen. and He gave the right to become the children of God. So amen. by receiving Christ means acknowledging your belief in Alleluia. Christ, amen. inviting Him to come amen. in your life, yes, turning amen. to God from your present amen. way of living. Amen. Uh, which is repentance. And then begin, Hallelujah. beginning the adventure of letting mm -hmm. God direct your life. Hallelujah. And the moment you ask, it's done. Amen. Jesus has come. Right? So it says Amen. here, Lord, dear God, I know that uh, we are sinners Hallelujah. and we are separated from you. Amen. 
Amen. Thank you that Jesus Christ died for our place, in Amen. our place. We ask Lord Jesus Christ to uh, forgive our sins and to come into our new life. Hallelujah. Please begin to direct our life. And Hallelujah. thank you for forgiving us, Lord. Hallelujah. And, and give us eternal life. In Jesus' name, amen. Amen. Hallelujah. So, part till three. next time, we have a uh, part two, and yes. uh, we're going to have mm. another um, episode. Yes. Yeah, the life changing power of accepting Jesus Christ as our Savior. Mm -hmm. So, don't forget to subscribe, subscribe. Likes, likes, and comments. And if you have any questions or any prayer requests, please yes. don't hesitate to put a comment and ask uh, you know whatever you want us to pray for you and help us also to uh, spread the gospel of God uh, around the world amen remember Jesus loves you we love you too may God bless you and your family John 3:16 yes Justin John 3:16 amen God bless amen amen, amen. <laughs>